Well, uh, there's dirt that used to be in the ground. They're digging out for a new grave over there. So that's the width of the uh, casket, as you can tell. Those guys do hard work. They actually roll out a metal, a metal uh, on-ramp onto the grass, and that way uh, they don't, they don't uh, disturb the grass with the big bulldozer. So, with that having been said, uh, thanks for watching those videos. I really had a lot of fun. I keep everything, guys. Uh, what you don't realize is, as long as my videos are, I usually uh, have three, three or four times as long. Uh, of length of raw footage to work from so there's a lot of editing going on uh, either way you look at it so as long as some of these videos appeared over the years they were really much longer when I was filming them so uh, that's how that works so it was really a, a really great uh, time working with Sullivan's projects we now complete eight years and we are just we'll keep going you know uh, NCIS made it for 15 so let's see if we can beat them <laughs> Well, here we are at the uh, Veteran Cemetery, just to the <coughs> west, to the west of Sierra Vista. Uh, nice day today, actually. Uh, every year, well, first of all, let me tell you, Sierra Vista really, really gets into some holidays here. <coughs> the first big one is uh, Veterans Day. <coughs> And the city used to actually have flags all up and down Fry Boulevard, you know, hanging uh, from poles and stuff overlooking the street. And they were beautiful. They replaced them with these banners that looked like the shape, you know, the colors of a flag. They're really ugly. I don't know why they did that. I really like the old flags. But the town still has a huge Veterans Day parade. And uh, it's really huge here. They'll have volunteers come out here and put flags on every one of these uh, grave sites out here. The other big uh, holiday here, I mean it's huge, is Christmas. Uh, the city has a huge, huge Christmas Day Parade, just like they had the Veterans Day Parade. I think both are put on by the Chamber of Commerce, actually, with some other sponsors. Uh, just really huge Christmas and Veterans Day here. Uh, so around Christmas, volunteers will come out and lay wreaths at the graves of all of the uh, gravestones here. <coughs> They spend several hours doing that, and there's actually a lot of them, so there's a lot of gravestones here. Um, I don't know who pays for that, but it all gets done, so thank you, whoever, whoever uh, paid for that. Uh, the midnight mass is not at midnight. It's at 1130, <laughs> so there's a lot of people that aren't here yet. So uh, they'll be here by 12, <laughs> so expect a long homily, and uh, that a lot of people will be late, very late. And we even have the... Uh, Sierra Vista Police Department here tonight. And here they all are all ready to set up for going to Mass tonight. Got all three priests plus Richard and Joseph here.
really can't tell here, but there is a wall of uh, hail and snow coming this way. They're dumping, uh, the, the clouds are dumping uh, all sorts of precipitation. And we've seen uh, temperature range, ranges here today from uh, from Hawaii to uh, Alaska. <laughs> so it all happened real fast. Uh, all of a sudden it got real, real cold in my house. So I had to shut the windows down and go see what's going on here. So we're getting our fair share of uh, snow up here on the mountains. I, before it got, got all clattered over again, you could really see a lot of snow. So today's the 26th, made it through Christmas, and uh, let's go and enjoy the rest of the year.
Well, guys, welcome to Border County, USA, episode 35. And uh, I said I wasn't going to make this uh, episode about snow this month, <laughs> or this week, and I won't. But uh, the, re the reason I gave yesterday was because we can expect a lot more than this. And uh, sure enough, we now have snow on the ground here in Sierra Vista. Uh, on the streets so far, it's melting, so no uh, snow plows or uh, rock ice required. <laughs> it's kind of interesting to see snow here. It's not really one of the reasons I moved down here, but for those who like uh, diversity in, in weather from a dry heat uh, of 105 to uh, what it is right now at, at 20, <laughs> you can get it right here. Actually, 2020 was the overnight low last night, and uh, there's an awful lot of kids I'm seeing on Facebook right now who are just enjoying the heck out of this, so it's, it's a rare treat. But uh, like I said, uh, so far the, the streets are clear, and that's the good thing. And uh, it's uh, finally winter. We have a winter blizzard here that's going to last about maybe another day or so. And then we'll get on our way to summer. <laughs>